My name is Kim Klasik, and I'm running for Congress in Maryland's 7th District. And like Shirley Chisholm, I'm unbought and unbossed. Let me remind you, the Democrats have controlled this part of Baltimore City for over 50 years. And they have run this beautiful place right into the ground. Abandoned buildings, liquor stores on every corner, drug addicts, guns on the street. That's now the norm in many neighborhoods. You'd think Maryland taxpayers would be getting a whole lot since our taxes are out of control. Instead, we're paying for decades of incompetence and corruption. Sadly, the same cycle of decay exists in many of America's Democrat-run cities. And yet the Democrats still assume that black people will vote for them, no matter how much they let us down and take us for granted. We're sick of it. We're not going to take it anymore. The days of blindly supporting the Democrats are coming to an end. In Baltimore, we have the highest number of black Republicans in the entire country running for office this election cycle. Joe Biden believes we can't think for ourselves, that the color of someone's skin dictates their political views. We're not buying the lies anymore. You and your party have neglected us for far too long. We want safety in our neighborhoods. We want to make the most of the federal opportunity zone I'm standing in right now in West Baltimore. We want higher paying jobs and more business opportunities. We want lower taxes. We want school choice. We want a chance to get ahead, not just get by. That's what President Trump promised, and that's what President Trump delivered. I want Baltimore to be an example to Republicans around the country that we can compete in our inner cities if we reach out to the citizens and deliver real results. President Trump is bringing this country back roaring. He's bringing the American spirit to life for all Americans. So I'm asking you to help President Trump complete this great American comeback. And then I'm asking you to help me start this great Baltimore comeback. Thank you and God bless America.